in DLI, basically what happens is when first I look at, uh, I think many people, I told this many times also, I first look at all the four sets, all four sets or five sets, okay, all the sets and I try to have a priority order so that there is less confusion in my head. If I get stuck in a set, I know what is the next set I won't attempt. So when I look at all the five sets, I again look at it slightly thoroughly. I don't spend too much time, but I try to see what is the kind of uh, set it is. Secondly, I look at some of the questions to see whether this is an individual question uh, type of set or a group set. An individual question set is basically where you have to solve each question individually. A group set is once you solve the group, you can answer all the questions immediately. I would always try to prefer a group set as compared to an individual set. So once I go through all of these things, I make a priority order. I say that, okay, I'm going to first attempt the third set, then the second set, something like that. Once I have the priority order, I start with the sets. And if I get stuck in a set, it depends on the type of uh, getting stuck it is. Sometimes I get the answer, but I realize that I made a mistake. I didn't consider a particular case or I assume certain things and I come to the answer. But when I'm looking at the questions, I figured out that, okay, something is not adding up. At that point, I try to spend, try to understand where I went wrong. And within 30 seconds or 40 seconds, if I'm able to figure out that, okay, this is the mistake I made, I will still stick to that set. I will again solve it. Because if I figured out where I made the mistake, solving it again is much faster. It won't take me 10 minutes or 12 minutes. Once I identified where I went wrong, uh, I have to just correct it. It will be like panic. It will also be like demoralizing because I feel, okay, I made a mistake. I'm wasting so much valuable time. But I still stick with that set if I've identified where I went wrong and I try to solve it. And second time I get it correct within like say three, four minutes. But if I solve the set and I feel I made it correct, but somehow it is not adding up and I spend 30 seconds, 40 seconds trying to figure out where I made the mistake and I'm not able to figure out where I made the mistake. Then I leave it. I go to the next set. But I will always try to come back to this set uh, afterwards because I feel I read the entire set because if you understand time understanding whatever is given in the group also takes a lot of time it will take you at least four five minutes for you to understand all the instructions that are given in the set if you're trying to attempt a new set it it is completely new here you know the theme you know the setup you know who are the characters you know all of it but somehow you made some mistake somewhere you are not able to identify where you made that mistake but still, this is a massive advantage that you have as compared to a completely new set. The problem is, if I didn't identify where I went wrong, I won't sit there and try to figure out where I went wrong. I will want to give a break for myself, try to solve some other set, but again, come back to this set after a small break so that I kind of look at it with a new pair of eyes and try to solve it and try to figure it out. Many times this works out for me.